keeping energy use and costs down. How does Vortex do this? Our Spa World CEO, Andrew Pullen, will run through the ins and outs of SpaNet. All right, Andrew, so I can see a lot of the equipment here under the spa has got um, SpaNet labelled on it. So tell me about SpaNet. Yeah, so SpaNet Annabella is an Australian company. Uh, Vortex has been working with SpaNet for about 15 years. And over that time, they've grown to being a market leader in the spa equipment and pump industry. Now, if you're looking around for a spa, there's really three brands of equipment that you should be keeping your eye out for. One is SpaNet, very good. The second is Balboa, uh, which is American. And the third is Gecko, which is Canadian. All three are very, very good. SpaNet has a number of key technologies that we'll talk about a little bit later on, um, which help to save the energy use that the spa uses and also makes the controlling of the spa very easy. But while we're under here, I'll touch on the pumps. Now, the SpaNet Smart Flow pumps are both extremely efficient in that they use less energy than most pumps. They're very quiet, not only because the quality of the pump and the bearings is very high, but also Vortex mount the pump on that rubber mount down there and that cuts down on the noise and vibration. There are two types of uh, pump under a Vortex spa or used in a Vortex spa. Three of you include the air blower. The first pump is called a circulation pump. And in the SpaNet system, that's programmable. So it's a smaller pump, it uses about one sixth the energy of the large jet pumps, and it does all of the filtration and heating. So very efficient but also silent. So when you're sitting in the spa with the jets off, staring at the stars, and you hear virtually no noise, which is a great thing. The second type of pump is the big jet pumps that we have back here. They're a very powerful pump. They really only come on when you press the jet button, when you want that great hydrotherapy that a Vortex is going to give you. Now, many spas on the market use the larger pump to do both the hydrotherapy, but also the heating and filtration, meaning you're spending more energy than you need to to get the job done. So I definitely always recommend having a dedicated circulation pump for the filtration and heating and a dedicated jet pump to do the hydrotherapy performance. Lastly, tucked away in the back there is a SpaNet air blower. And um, for anybody that's used spas a bit, they'd be familiar with the concept of an air blower. It blows nice bubbles, the kids love it. On the Vortex Spa, it has the added benefit of being connected to an aromatherapy system. So you can actually put aromatherapy canisters in the top of the spa, and it brings a fragrance through with that air. 13 different um, flavors or aromas. Um, so that's another fantastic feature of the Vortex Spa. We hope this video has helped you learn more about the SpaNet system. Thanks for watching.